Have you heard about the Pearl of the Danube? It is also known as Budapest, the capital of Hungary. It is called so because of its stunning location along the banks of the Danube River that divides the city into two parts, Buda and Pest. But Budapest has much more to offer to you. Therefore, for you who want to visit Budapest, this video is perfect for you. We'll let you know everything for the best time to visit until the hidden gem you have to know. Welcome to Journey. Do you know what Budapest is famous for? If you guess correctly, Budapest is known as the thermal bath capital of the world. Underneath the city is a large resource of spring water that produces 70 million liters of thermal water each day. Sounds cool, right? Section 1 Best Time to Visit and Weather Learn about the ideal time to visit, seasonal variations, and weather conditions. So, what is the best time of year to visit Budapest? The best months to visit are March to May and September to November. During these shoulder seasons, the weather is pleasant and the city is not overcrowded with tourists. The climate in Budapest is always rather pleasant, but temperatures rarely exceed tolerable levels. You might not have to really worry about the extreme weather here. Before we move on, hit that subscribe button now so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos. Section 2 Getting Around Discover transportation options available such as airport, public transportation, taxes, or rental services. Besides that, you don't need to worry about the transportation here since it's easy to get around thanks to its excellent public transport network operated by the Budapest Center of Transport. We'll discuss it one by one. First, we have the metro, the easiest and quickest way to get around the city for a first-timer. There are currently four metro lines, so it's simple to navigate the city. Single ticket costs 350 Hungarian forints, and you can change metro lines with a single ticket. Of course, with the option of a longer period, you can get a lower price which covers all modes of transportation. Then there is Budapest Tram Network, which is extensive and covers many areas not served by the metro. Trams are a popular means of transit in the city, providing scenic routes along the Danube and through some of the city's most charming areas. The tram fare is the same as the metro fare. After that, the bus network supports the metro and tram lines by connecting areas not served by rail transportation. Buses run often and are especially beneficial for getting to places that are unreachable by metro or tram. Next is the suburban trains. They connect Budapest to closed towns and villages and are handy for day getaways or visiting the cities outside. The best way to view Budapest is by boat. And if you're on a tight budget, the BKK boat service is only a couple of dollars around 754 It's one trip in the summer. The other mode to enjoy Budapest is by bike. Budapest bike lanes are expanding. You may rent bikes from several rental firms or utilize the city's public bike sharing system like Booby. Can be rented for a variety of times, including 24 hours, 72 hours, seven days, and more. Section three, accommodation. Find information on hotels, resorts, or other accommodation options suitable for different budgets and preferences. There are numerous hotels and hostels to select from. Here are our top luxury, mid-range, and budget picks for you in Budapest. We'll dive into luxury accommodation first. We have the famous New York Cafe. For nearly a century, the ground level of the Anantara New York Palace has been the meeting place for Budapest literary. Then, Cosmo Luxury Hotel Suites and Spa. The exterior of the hotel features asymmetrical carved stone and pink brick architecture, while Cosmo's interior design style combines Budapest charm. Our last luxury recommendation is the Mystery Hotel Budapest, which is one of Budapest's newest luxury lodgings. Next category is Mid-Range Stay. Rum Hotel is everything an excellent mid-priced hotel should be. Fun, quirky, and intimate, and just across the street from our favorite brunch spot in Budapest, Portobello. After that, we have Mamezen Residence Isabella. It's close to Sejini Thermal Baths and the designer boutiques lining Andrasi Avenue. Then there is Prestige Hotel Budapest. And finally, here are our top hostels for you. First, we have the Hive Hostel. If you're looking to socialize, the Hive is definitely your best chance. One of Budapest's best new hostels is Maverick City Lodge, which goes to great lengths to provide a comfortable home for budget travelers. Finally, Wombat City Hostel Budapest provides a clean, pleasant, no-frills spot to rest your tired traveling bones. Section 4 Local Cuisine Explore the diverse culinary scene and must-try dishes, including local specialties and popular restaurants. Now it's time to know the famous Hungarian dishes you have to try. From the iconic goulash, a hearty beef stew with paprika and spices, to the delicious langos, a crispy deep-fried flatbread topped with garlic butter and cheese. 
Don't forget to try the comforting Tolta Caposta, stuffed cabbage leaves filled with a savory mix of meat and rice, or savor the house lay, a spicy fisherman's soup featuring freshwater fish and aromatic paprika. Budapest local cuisine offers a delightful choice of flavors, including the Hortha B. Palak Sinta, the irresistible Turo Sosa, and the delicious Dobos Tort. Top off your culinary adventure with Kurpus Kalex, the sweet chimney cake, or the Samoloi Galuska, a dreamy dessert layered with chocolate, rum, and walnuts. We hope you have a blast with the delicious Hungarian foods. Section 5 Top Attractions Discover the must visit places and popular tourist attractions in the destination. After discussing its food, let's look at the top locations in Budapest that will make a memorable trip for you. So, here they are. One of the most iconic landmarks in Budapest, the Hungarian Parliament Building is a stunning example of Neo-Gothic architecture. Located on the banks of the Danube River, this magnificent building is the seat of the National Assembly of Hungary. You could take a guided tour to explore its impressive interior and learn about Hungary's history and politics. Next, situated on the Buda side of the city, Buda Castle is a historical complex that offers breathtaking views of the city. You can explore the Royal Palace, Matthias Church, and the Fisherman's Bastion. The cobbled streets and medieval architecture of Castle Hill create a charming and magical atmosphere. As we know earlier, Budapest is renowned for its thermal baths, and Saitinye Thermal Bath is the largest and one of the most famous in the city. You can have the experience to relax in its numerous indoor and outdoor pools filled with natural hot spring water and experience the traditional Hungarian spa culture. Some alternatives are Gellert, Rugas, Lukex, and Kirli. After that, there is an impressive neoclassical cathedral street, Stephen's Basilica, which is dedicated to Hungary's first king, Street Stephen. You can climb to the Dome's observation deck for panoramic views of Budapest's skyline or marvel at the stunning interior and the holy right-hand relic of Street Stephen. Let's move to other places. Dodoni Street Synagogue is known as the Great Synagogue. It's the largest synagogue in Europe and an important symbol of Budapest's Jewish heritage. The Jewish quarter surrounding the synagogue is also a vibrant neighborhood filled with trendy calves, bars, and street art. And lastly, this Grand Hero Square is a tribute to Hungary's historical figures and leaders. The Millennium Monument, with its statues of important national figures, stands proudly in the center. Section 6 Festivals and Unique Events Learn about vibrant festivals and unique events that showcase the local culture and traditions. After knowing a few things, we need to know what is usually celebrated, so who knows we can be more immersed in the culture of Budapest. Among the top three must-visit festivals, a second festival stands out as a highlight, drawing music lovers from around the world with its spectacular lineup of international artists and electrifying atmosphere on a Buda island in August. If you are a cultural enthusiast, the Budapest Spring Festival in April is a respected event, offering a captivating blend of classical music, opera, dance, theater, and visual arts performances at various venues across the city. Additionally, the Budapest International Wine Festival in September is a celebration of Hungarian wine culture, where you can try exquisite local wines, traditional sweets, and let yourself in a lively and convivial ambience at the beauty of Buda Castle. Section 7 Hidden Gems Uncover lesser-known off-the-beaten-path spots or attractions that offer a unique and authentic experience. Since we have covered most of the things you should know about Budapest, we should talk about Budapest hidden gem you should miss. If you want to see the best view of Budapest, we recommend you go to Gallard Hill. But you'll have to go on a climb, which is located on the Buda side of the city. From here, you have the most amazing perspective of the city. That's even better if you can reach a sunrise or sunset view. Gallard Hill is home to the almost 150-year-old citadel, as well as an extension of this ancient military structure. A Statue of Liberty is also created in memory of the Soviets and Hungarians who died fighting to liberate Hungary from the Nazis. Gallard Hill rises 235 meters into the air, thus getting to the top requires a strong pair of legs. But once you're there and see the view, you won't regret it. Budapest is indeed a destination that truly captivates the hearts of travelers by its culture and history. We hope we got you all covered about Budapest. 
Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more travel tips.